I get so excited when other women tell me that they found jewelry they forgot they had. I've had several tell me that they found something that belonged to their grandma and how much they love being able to see it every day. And every time I hear a story like that, I just can't help but smile. I loved the idea of putting my jewelry in with my clothes in my closet. It was like a light bulb moment. This is it. This is my chance. This is a problem that I can solve. I immediately, you know, talked to my girlfriends, told them about the idea. It took us about two years to perfect our Roxy design. A lot of late nights, a lot of wine to get the creative juices flowing, but it's been worth it. Roxy's our idea of what a glamorous solution to the jewelry storage dilemma should be. You can put all of your accessories on Roxy. You can put your necklaces, bracelets, your earrings, your rings, sunglasses, your watches. You can use both sides of Roxy and you can pack your earrings on there. When I saw Sarah Blakely on Oprah, that was it. That was the moment I knew I wanted to be an entrepreneur. And I thought if she could do it, then I could do it too. We definitely want to design more products, but what's more important to us is that we're an inspiration to other women. I love the opportunity to bring women together and direct our creative energy towards helping other women. It's been incredible. At our Roxy launch party, we did a wall and it said, how do you let your sparkle out? And we asked our friends and family to Tell us how they let their sparkle out. What makes you feel unique and be happy? It's about inspiring women to seize the big moments, savor the small ones, and celebrate the sparkle inside each and every one of us. So we want to know, how do you let your sparkle out? Tell us on Facebook, get inspired by our Let Your Sparkle Out blog and our Pinterest pin board. Help us spread the Let Your Sparkle Out movement one Roxy at a time. Are you with us? Let your sparkle out. Are you just smiling the whole time? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I know. I'm like not sure if I just I just stand there and like cheese. Yeah. Okay. All right.